Electrical wiring A network of wires, drawn connecting the meter board, to the various energy-consuming loads, like lamps, fans, refrigerators, etc., through control, and, protective devices, for efficient distribution of power, is known as electrical wiring. Electrical wiring, is a process of connecting cables, and wires, to the related devices, such as, fuse, switches, sockets, lights, fans, etc., to the main distribution board. It is a specific structure to the utility pole, for continuous power supply. Domestic wiring. Electrical wiring, done in residential and commercial buildings, to provide power for lights, fans and other domestic appliances is known as domestic wiring. In the house, after passing through the meter, the main fuse and the main switch, the wires are taken straight through the house. Note. This system should only be used in small buildings as it is impossible to divide up the single mains, for testing purposes. Wiring Materials Electrical wire is made of materials, like copper, aluminum, and silver. But, silver is expensive, so, copper and aluminum are mostly used in wiring. Materials are classified into three types according to their properties. Conducting material Copper It is a good conductor of electricity. It is used in wiring materials and cables. It has low resistance, and, is used for conduction of electricity at high, medium, and, low voltage. Aluminum It is lightweight, and, cheaper in comparison to, copper. It is silvery white in color, and, it has a soft texture. Insulating materials Insulating materials are used for insulating purpose. These types of materials are bad conductors of current. For example, rubber, paper, mica, wood, glass, and cotton. Semiconductor material The elemental semiconductors, are those composed of single species of atoms, such as, silicon, germanium, and tin in column 4, and, selenium and, tellurium in, column 6 of the periodic table. Types of wiring Electrical wiring system is classified into five categories. Cleat wiring Casing wiring Batten wiring Conduit wiring Concealed wiring Let's discuss them in detail. Cleat wiring. In this type of wiring, insulated conductors, usually VIR, vulcanized Indian rubber, are supported on porcelain or wooden cleats. The cleats have two halves, one base, and the other, cap. The cables are placed in the grooves, provided in the base, and then, the cap is placed. Both are fixed securely on the walls, by 40 mm long screws. The cleats are easy to erect, and are fixed 4.5 to 15 centimeters apart. Note. This wiring is suitable for temporary installations, where, cost is the main criteria, but not the appearance. We can now understand the advantages and disadvantages of cleat wiring. Advantages. Cheap, and, easy wiring. Easy to detection faults. Easy to repair. Alteration and addition is easy. Easy installation. Materials can be retrieved for reuse. Flexibility provided for inspection, modifications, and expansion. Relatively economical, as skilled manpower not required. Disadvantages. Bad appearance. Exposed to weather will be affected by humidity, rain, smoke, sunlight. Chances of shock or fire. Only used in 220 volts in low ambient temperature. Not long lasting. Appearance is not good, and open system of wiring requires regular cleaning. Higher risk of mechanical injuries. K. 
Casing Wiring Material used in casing wiring VIR or PVC Insulated Wires Casing Enclosure Made of Wood or Plastic Capping Made of Wood or Plastic Procedure of Casing Wiring This kind of wiring is very old fashioned. Generally PVC or VIR insulated wires are carried through the casing enclosure and capping is used to cover the casing. Advantages and Disadvantages of Casing Wiring Advantages Cheap and easy to install Strong and durable wiring Customization can be done easily Safe from smoke, dust, rain, and steam Disadvantages Very costly Not suitable for weather, with high humidity, and acidic conditions Insects like termites or ants can damage wooden casing and capping high risk of fire batten wiring batten wiring is one of the basic wiring methods that is used today it is also called as cts cable tire sheathed or trs tough rubber sheathed wiring here insulated wires are run through the straight teak wooden battens these are fixed on ceilings or walls with plugs or screws. The cables are fitted onto the battens with tin brass link clips that are fastened on with rust resistant nails. Some of the advantages and disadvantages of batten wiring are Advantages Easy installation Cheap in material cost Appearance is better Customization is easy Less chance of leakage current Easy installation and is durable. Lower risk of short circuit. Cheaper than casing and capping system of wiring. Disadvantages. Not suitable for outdoor wiring. Humidity, smoke, steam, etc. directly affect wires. Heavy wires are not recommended for this wiring scheme. Only suitable for voltage below 250 volts. High risk of fire. Danger of mechanical injury. Hence, should not be used in workshops. Skilled workmen are required. Conduit wiring. In this system, PVC or VIR insulated cables run through mild steel or PVC pipes called conduits, providing good protection against mechanical injuries and fire due to short circuits. They are supported over the walls, and the system is best suited for domestic and commercial installations. Advantages No risk of fire, and good protection against mechanical injury. The lead and return wires can be carried in the same tube. Earthing and continuity is assured. Waterproof and troubleshooting is easy. Shockproof with proper earthing and bonding durable and maintenance free the safest wiring appearance is better no risk of fire or mechanical wear and tear no risk of damage of cable insulation safe from humidity smoke steam long lasting disadvantages requires skilled workmanship Erection is quite complicated and is time consuming. Risk of short circuit under wet conditions due to condensation of water in tubes. Very expensive. Installation is not easy. Not easy to customize for future. Hard to detect the faults. Concealed wiring. Same materials are used in concealed wiring as conduit wiring. Concealed wiring is properly named as concealed conduit wiring. It is very laborious to install. The layout of this wiring is done under the plaster of the wall of the building. Conduit pipes are buried under the plaster of wall with GI wire inside. After, with the help of GI wires, the main PVC insulated cables are drawn through the conduit. Advantages and disadvantages of concealed wiring are same as conduit wiring.
wiring system at home. The main supply is delivered to houses using a three core wiring called the live, the neutral, and the earth. These wires supply electricity to separate circuits within the house. The live wire and neutral wire coming from the electric pole enter a box fitted just outside our house. The live wire has a potential of 220 volts and the neutral wire carries zero potential. The two wires then enter the electricity meter which records the electrical power consumed by us in kilowatt hour. These two wires coming out of their meter are then connected to a main switch and distribution centers which is placed in a main circuit box. From distribution center, wires drawn to distribution boards and from the distribution boards to various components like electric bulbs, fan, television, refrigerator, etc. The distribution circuits are always connected in parallel combination. Note In a parallel circuit, if a fault or short circuiting happens, the particular distribution center shut off and prevent the circuits from failing. Factors affecting wiring system Durability Type of wiring selected should conform to standard specifications so that it is durable. That is, without being affected by the weather conditions, fumes, etc. Safety The wiring must provide safety against leakage, shock, and fire hazards. Appearance Electrical wiring should give an aesthetic appeal to the interiors. Cost It should not be prohibitively expensive. Accessibility The switches and plug points provided should be easily accessible. There must be provision for further extension of the wiring system, if necessary. Maintenance cost The maintenance cost should be minimum. Mechanical safety the wiring must be protected against any mechanical damage. To know more, sign up to www.linksy.in.